एक्सरसाइज टेन पॉइंट थ्री क्वेश्चन नंबर वन फाइंड द एरिया ऑफ द रेक्टेंगल्स हु साइड्स आर गिवन टू अस नाउ हेयर इन दिस एक्सरसाइज वी हैव टू फाइंड द एरियाज ऑफ द फिगर्स मैंशन इन फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन दे हैव गिवन फोर पार्ट्स सो इन ईच ऑफ द पार्ट वी हैव टू फाइंड द एरिया ऑफ रेक्टेंगल सो एज इन द इंट्रोडक्शन वी हैव स्टडीड अबाउट द फॉर्मूलाज फर्स्ट पार्ट इज ए Three centimeter and four centimeter. The, these dimensions are given to us. So we are considering three centimeter as length and b a four centimeter as breadth. The formula for finding the area of rectangle is length into breadth. So length is three, breadth is four. Multiply and we will get the answer. Three fours are twelve, and we have to specify the unit with our answer also. Centimeter square. Or we can write it as twelve square centimeter. In this form, also we can mention. Now, similarly, your B and C part both are same. In this method only, students, you will do these two parts. Here, I am explaining D part now. Now, D part. What is the difference in D part? Two meter and seventy centimeter is given to us. whenever we are uh, uh, dimensions are given to us these units should be same here one length is in meter the other breadth is in centimeter so what you have to do either convert meter into centimeter or centimeter into meter so here i have converted meter into centimeter 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter 2 meter is equal to 200 cm so therefore length is 200 and breadth is 70 only formula of area is length into breadth multiply both find the product you will get the answer and remember uh, the unit is now cm square so this was your question number 1 a and d part let's move ahead with question number 2 now find the area of the squares again we have to find the area but this time the figure is change it is square now let us do a a part 10 cm side is 10 cm we have to find the area formula is side multiply by side so 10 multiply by 10 is 100 and the unit is cm always whenever we are finding the area of any specific figure the answer in answers this square will always come with the unit so here the unit is cm the answer is 100 cm square b part 14 cm students you will do it by yourself you just have to multiply 14 and 2 into 14 let's do c part now now here in c part 5 meter is given side is 5 meter find the area side multiply by side the answer is 25 meter square so this was your question number 2 let's move ahead with question number 3 now what question 3 is saying the length and breadth of three rectangles are as given a 9 meter 6 cm 17 by 3 meter 4 c part 4 meter 14 meter which one has the largest area and which one has the smallest area now this is only one question don't think ki these are three separate we have to find area separately but it will be considered as one question only now here in a part 9 meter and 6 meter is given we have to find the area formula is length into breadth multiply both you will get the answer same goes for b part also 17 meter multiply by 3 meter Uh, area length into breadth find the answer same for c part also we have to find the area in all three parts okay and the formula is same length multiply by breadth now the question is asking which part has the largest area and which part has the smallest area we have to we have to compare all three areas here it is 54 51 56 so the largest area is 56 therefore largest area is equal to c part and smallest area is 51 is the smallest number so b part answer is smallest so th these two are your answer so this was question number 3 exercise 10.3